Hi, this is Naomi from Pharos AI. Over the past nine months, we've worked with many large organizations rolling out AI coding assistance and have infused our learnings into our AI Copilot evaluation module to help you demonstrate and optimize ROI. Our out-of-the-box dashboards help demystify the adoption of new AI technology with a full measurement framework that goes from pilots to rollouts to optimization. The Pharos AI solution measures the impact of AI coding assistance on productivity and outcomes. We help you track adoption and usage over time, measure the time savings and economic benefit, and identify which teams benefit the most and how saved time is reinvested. We capture development sentiment with out-of-the-box surveys. You can benchmark speed, quality, and security improvements relative to your peers. You can observe before and after metrics for developers that are using the coding assistant and see where new bottlenecks are emerging and mitigate any unintended consequences quickly. Our analytics go far beyond the basics available in the GitHub Copilot API by providing full history, advanced filtering, A-B testing, and before and after analysis on the impacts coding assistants are having on tasks, deployments, quality, reliability, and satisfaction. So let's dive in. The summary dashboard provides a high-level overview of the ROI provided by your coding assistant in terms of adoption, usage, time savings, and economic benefit. With the adoption dashboard, you can track how many licenses have been attributed to your developers and how many are actively being used. You can also see which teams are most active to understand which teams are benefiting the most and which ones may require extra training. The usage section provides a detailed view into the code generated by the coding assistant. You can see the number of lines of code generated over time with a breakdown by language and editor. You can also monitor if the acceptance rate of generated code is increasing as your developers become more comfortable with the tool and it becomes better over time. Data is also provided on the usage of Copilot chat, including daily chat turns and acceptances. You can also get a view into power users who could train others in your organizations based on their success and into unused licenses that may no longer be required or require additional training for activation. The A-B test dashboard. We recommend evaluating coding assistance via small scale pilot at first, where licenses are provided to a select number of developers or teams, the A group, while other developers of the B group keep working without it. Ideally, your A and B groups are similar so you can compare performance and outcomes fairly. With Pharos, you can compare different velocity and quality metrics that are likely to be most immediately impacted by using AI coding assistance. The key promise of coding assistance is to save developers time while coding. Here, you can see if there is a notable difference in velocity between developers using a coding assistant and those that do not, looking at metrics such as PR merge rate, review time, or task throughput. Moving fast, however, can have an adverse impact on quality. With Pharos, you can ingest data from static code analysis tools like SonarCube to monitor PR test coverage or code smells, as well as PR size. The Rollout Dashboard. Once your developers have been using their coding assistant for a longer period of time, you can start comparing before and after metrics. With Pharos, you can benchmark speed and quality improvements. We have worked with many organizations rolling out coding assistants in the last year, and those benchmarks represent what good looks like based on what we've seen. The Impact Dashboard. Once your organization has deployed coding assistance more broadly, you can start evaluating impact on metrics further downstream. With broader usage, individual gains can start to translate into meaningful impact on downstream velocity metrics such as lead time. In some cases, however, these gains can be erased by bottlenecks in the software development lifecycle. See which teams are seeing meaningful improvements to bottom line velocity metrics and identify existing or new bottlenecks that prevent them from reaping maximum benefits, such as longer review times. With more usage, downstream impact on quality can start to be felt more acutely, either in a positive or a negative way. With Pharos, you can monitor the effect on incidents, bugs, and other quality metrics. The Cadence Surveys Dashboard. We recommend augmenting this telemetry data with qualitative and satisfaction data from developers' surveys that can be run every few weeks or months. Out-of-the-box surveys are provided with questions related to the frequency of use, time savings, and developer satisfaction. Custom surveys can also be ingested. The PR Surveys Dashboard. 
Another option is to run surveys in the flow of work, for example, when a PR is submitted. This can provide more accurate data on time savings as well as contextual information on which development tasks benefit the most from using a coding assistant and where time is being reinvested. For GitHub Copilot users, Pharos AI is downloadable for free on the GitHub Marketplace. Please reach out if you have any questions at www.pharos.ai.